Probably you found this question the easiest. Why do you think you found that one the easiest? It's obvious because this is already written. You can see the objects, whatever they happen to be. You can see the letters and you can count them and say there's four O's and two G's and there's, uh, what, eight, seven altogether? So it's this over this and this, right? You can, you can do that because you can see the objects. This one is a bit harder because it's not already written out for you, but it does say there are three of these and four of those, and it tells you the total. So you can do that one almost as easily. Some of you would have more success with this, though, if you wrote out T, 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 F, 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 F. There's, and actually wrote out the letters just so that you avoid getting mixed up. There's three of one kind, four of the other. There's seven altogether, three of one kind, four of the other. The last one you find difficult because... Can we listen, please, or at least stop talking, those of you that are? This one's the hardest one because it doesn't say anything about how many objects. It doesn't say anything about which ones are identical or anything like that. You have to come up with that on your own. This is a difficult question to apply this to if you don't realize you can apply it here. You have to realize that to get from here to here, you have to make six moves, right? It does say you can only go right and down. It does tell you those are your two types of moves. I would use R to represent that. I would use D to represent this. You have to make six moves in total, right? You could go, you could do it this way. You could go right, right, down, 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 down. You could represent that with this, right? R, then R, then the four downs. Or you could go, you could go, uh, you know, some other path here. You could go down, right, down, right, down, down. You could write those six letters. Basically, you have six moves, and there are four rights. And no, there's two rights. There's four downs, and two to the right. So you could do this by saying six factorial over four factorial, two factorial. The hard part here is not the calculation of this. It's not the actual working this out. It's the thinking about what's involved. I think some of you try to jump to this without actually stopping and really analyzing the situation. The hard part of this unit is analyzing the situation. A lot of you want to jump into, oh, there's 8 or there's 10 or there's whatever. Don't just try to count something quickly and put numbers in there. Think about what's happening. If you're in doubt, can, it, can we uh, write out a few of them? The best thing you can do is write out a few of them using symbols in any one of these. It, it would help to write out a few of these if you're not sure or these if you're not sure. Write out a few of what you're asking for. Before you try to try to jump to doing this, Pretend you're a grade 8 student who's been asked this question and just actually start writing some of them out. That's where we started with this. The, the advantage to that is then you understand the question. Sometimes we try to jump ahead to knowing what we're doing because you've seen this before and you've looked at it, but you jump past the understanding of the question. Pretend you're a grade 8 student or even younger and just start writing them out because if a grade 8 kid was asked this, they, would have, they couldn't do this they would have to start writing this out. Wait a sec, they could all be true, or these could come last, or this could go here. Not, not that you want to write them all out like that, but do a few of them till you understand, especially for something like this. Draw a few of the pathways and think about how you could represent them with individual objects or letters or symbols. All right? Do you want another higher level question here now? I, I think you should... I think we should have a, a, a timely higher level question here. It's so.